Here at Mobile Glass Blowing Studios, we have a passion for providing hot glass access to artists and organizations and their students and patrons. Our durable and affordable mobile glass blowing equipment is in use all around the globe in private and public art studios, backyards and garages, high schools and universities, and more. About half of the equipment we've sold since we opened in 2015 was built to start a new glass studio where one didn't exist before. This means that there are now around 100 new businesses where people can gather around a fire and experience the mesmerizing process of hot glass through demonstrations and workshops. As a university art professor, I find glass blowing inspiring to teach. I see students open up over a period of time. I get to watch their creativity grow. Once they harness the techniques, what the student makes becomes an expression of their experiences, perspectives, and concerns. Over the years, I've seen many students graduate with no venue to continue their glasswork in, which is a big part of why Phil and I started this business. Mobile glass is a form of activism for us. We build equipment at low margins. We make it accessible to buy, to own, and then the artist provides access to hundreds and thousands of other people to be impacted through an experience with hot glass. Small glass furnaces and studios have been a part of the American studio glass movement from the beginning. The development of small glass furnaces made glass accessible to people outside of the factories, specifically academics and artists. Since then, glass studios have developed and grown largely in brick and mortar shops with fairly large furnaces and high overhead. We wanted to bring back some of the original pioneering spirit of the small studio while also increasing its reach, so we decided to put just about everything on wheels. This feature, along with the specific considerations for durability, allow our users to transport our equipment easily and blow glass just about anywhere. The platform is really now just limited to the imagination. I'm passionate about making a positive impact on the world in some way. I enjoy teaching the most. The material itself is intense, which requires focus and makes you forget everything else. Many of the long-term students I've had discover that their boundaries are more self-imposed than anything else. Their accomplishments in the hot shop boosted their self-esteem and opened doors for them in aspects of their life outside of glass. It can be an emotionally challenging medium and there's something really therapeutic in the process. In the business, we want more people to be able to afford that kind of experience. Having the ability to have a small studio in a wide variety of locations and venues can help break down social and cultural barriers, which encourages diversity. And I love that. Glass is a great equalizer, and people are drawn to it as they are to a campfire. Through this business, I get to have a widespread positive impact without having to be in charge of it all. We're providing the tools that allow these experiences to happen. Our customers are doing some very interesting things, including programs for underserved and at-risk youth in tough areas of big cities. Through their experience in glass, the students are learning how to improve their communication skills the value of community and teamwork, and developing the tools to be able to focus on their work. The results of these programs are very tangible in these kids' lives and transcend far beyond the objects made in the furnace. Similar programs are happening with veterans groups, providing the space and support for veterans working through and coping with PTSD. Innovation and sustainability are core values in our business. We've developed multiple products that are helping reshape how glass artists work and interact with their audiences around the globe. Our continuous annealing tube, called the CAT60, attaches to a side port on a furnace and uses the heat already generated by that furnace. Its function is to cool the glass down at a much faster rate than your average studio. Work is ready in about an hour compared to the typical 8-12 to 12 hour cooling cycle traditionally used. This allows studio owners to send workshop students home with their pieces the same day instead of arranging pickup times later. Another innovation we have helped to develop with our friends from Organic Combustion Systems in North Carolina is using a waste veggie oil burner to heat our furnaces, which removes a reliance on fossil fuel to blow glass. Along with this mindset are several customers using this equipment to process post-consumer glass, helping to lower not only their costs, but their carbon footprint as well. A grant from FedEx would help us to upgrade the tooling in our shop so that we can design and create more innovative products that support our customers' goals and ways of working, thereby fueling their ability to reach even wider audiences with the wonder of hot glass. We are excited to be a part of this process 
and grateful to have been selected in the top 100 businesses.